Hi, I'm Jefferson Graham. Hey, hey. Oh, and I'm Ed Dade. And uh, you know, my man Ed here, he's got very expensive taste. He's got some $350 headphones that he's wearing on his head. I said, Ed Bank, $350 for headphones? These are Bose Quiet Comfort 3 headphones. They're noise cancellation headphones. I have I did buy them recently. I've reviewed them in the past. Uh, and they sound great. And be noise. And, and we're standing here on a busy street in San Francisco to see just how noise free they are. Well, I'm listening to the uh, Goldberg variations here, Jeff. And uh, I got to tell you, from Bach, and uh, they sound great. You know, well, I'm, me, oblivious, me, I'm oblivious to the noise around me. Well, let me check it out. $350, huh? I actually bought these in the Apple Store. What? I bought them in the Apple Store. I don't hear you. Well, Jeff, there's no question they're not cheap, and uh, they actually cost more than some of the iPods that I've been listening with them. So they're a bit of a luxury, but they do sound great, and if you travel a lot, especially on an airplane, they're terrific. There is, uh, there is a potential downside to the Bose, which is they use rechargeable batteries. Now, the battery lasts a long time, but if you happen to be somewhere where you're out of juice, you can't use the headphones at all with or without noise cancellation. And that's a potential advantage for these dead-on headphones, which are not cheap either, but they are $50 cheaper at $299. These use standard AAA batteries, so you can pretty much find a AAA battery almost anywhere. And even if you don't have a AAA battery, you can still use these headphones, you just lose the noise cancellation effect. Ed, I agree with you, they sound fantastic. Uh, I would love to be able to uh, spring for it. It's just not in my DNA. I envy you, but that's why we always have two opinions here. For USA Today, I'm Jefferson Graham. And I'm Ed Begg, and we'll see you next time. And in the meantime, I'm going to enjoy the music.